Welcome to the stream. The game has been patched. Um, yes. I was just reading. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Nerf to the character I'm playing because, of course, shouting is, uh, yeah, apparently strong. So, of course, I pick the strong thing and then they nerf it. So that's that's great. Anyway. Um, just opening with that. That's always fun. I'm guessing the damage reduction was too much later on, because right now it doesn't seem busted, but I'm guessing later it just becomes this thing that maybe behaves too well, I don't know. Anyway. Um... Whenever the game comes up on screen, I'll, I'll start walking around. There we go. OBS be a little bit slow picking up this game. So yeah, nerf to my character. Because it gets strong later, so that's that's fine. <sighs> it's, it's whatever. Uh, I think what I want to do. I mean, I was right. Yeah, okay. I should. I want to do this. This glitched out last time I played. Anyway, today's a bonus stream. I'm just gonna kind of kick back and chill. I've had a long work day, so um, instead of doing anything productive or just sitting there and watching stuff, I figured, okay, I want to play more of this, and I guess I may as well stream it. But it's gonna be. Fairly chill, I think. So no Zelda or anything like that tonight. It's just kicking back and just hammer time, you know? Now I'll open up with that stronghold, but um, I'll think I'll consider what else to do. I mean, potentially progressing the main quest tonight, and then I might do some dungeon exploration just to try and get more um, aspects. I think that's the plan. I should be consulting the Skarsglen map. Okay, hold up. Let me see. Where am I? Sorry, chat. I'm trying to get my reference point to where exactly I am. Okay, that's the... I am confused. Oh, no, no, I'm not. I see. I see where I am. Okay, there's a bunch of quests around here. Gotcha. I'm low on fury.
No, I didn't read a vulnerability to got any changes. Probably should have read that. It's okay. I just hyper focused on the part where the barbarian got nerfed. I guess if I die to it less, that means I've changed that, so. No sense in worrying about it. Just reading this fellow's entrails. The goatmen are encroaching ever more on our lands. I'm trying to determine why. How. With a bit of skill, we can learn a lot from someone's innards. Not many remember or practice the old ways. But if you split the gut and read the mess that pours out. Help me open the gut further, will you? I'm not getting a good reading. And my hands aren't as steady as they used to be. I'm bringing up the patch notes on my phone. <laughs> I want to see. Have they changed that? Oh no, but that's from the third. It's older. So what did they do a few days ago? Let's see. Yeah, man. They made a lot of changes to other classes. Barbarians is... The one that got hit with the nerf stick, I guess. Yeah, okay. Doesn't seem like they made a change, but it's fine. Parasites. There's not much left to read now. I had a hard enough time getting home. I wonder if it's got something to do with maybe. I'm trying to think why they wouldn't nerf that skill. Like, they really think it's that strong later. Alright, we got it now. This happened to me with Monk. <laughs> Launch of Diablo 3. I just always picked the stupid. The buildings that ended up getting nerfed. Uh. It's okay. Splendid. My visions have been clouded lately, weakened. Hopefully these entrails will tell us more. Let's see here. Just a moment. So what did you learn? Yes. Our people are starving. Going hungry while the goat men overrun our farms. These lands used to be protected, but... Well, we've no time now for this chatter. From my readings, I was able to see that attack on Keeler Farm nearby. I sensed a survivor. Hurry, find them. Okie dokie, hold on. Yeah, we should be popping one of these. Up close or at a distance. I have weapons for any engagement. Here's what's left. You know, one thing I'm surprised 
why they didn't add a tab for gems. It seems a bit weird. I'm kind of just thinking of that now. Anyway. Okay, let me get a reference point. There's two quests here, apparently. Smack signal reclamation. I, st I do want to do the stronghold. It's interesting. There's supposed to be a side quest here, but there's nothing. So maybe it comes up later. Alright, for now. Where's the farm? The farm is over there. There. These things are back. Someone, please. Yeah, hang on. Screaming for help us. Honestly, there's a bunch of stuff I have to deal with first. I'm out of fury. were taken to the tunnels tunnels was one safe but now it... we told them warned them not to destroy the ward stones who the chieftain i Ruig. he Okay. I may as well finish this off. Experience! Let's just do that. Damn. The tunnels the farmer mentioned must be the domain tunnels. If the goat men are taking prisoners there, that's likely where they're coming from. As for the chieftain, that ignorant boor. Well, there's no reasoning with him. See for yourself if you like. I've tried. I'm guessing that's Once the quest finished, that's supposed to be next door. Tunnels. Reinforcements are not. It's time we take back our lands.
Yeah, okay. What? No. I only want what's best for my people. But some of them are stuck in the old ways and can't see the way forward. The Cathedral of Light is our future. The famine may have been sent to test us, but we will persevere. I will oh, be boy. strong for everyone. Faith and prayer will lead us out of the darkness. Not while I'm in town. <laughs> I, uh, I pressed right click to drop the hammer on the desk. It did not allow it. Hammer time was not allowed. See, I'm surprised. <laughs> I hope you're ready for this. If the goat men were strong outside town, they'll be that much stronger in here. I have a oh, going in the den. answers inside. Let's go. Ah, it's a dungeon. Oh boy. Maybe we'll get a good aspect. I suppose that's a thing to look forward to. I'm out of fury. Get back out. Is she still with me? You saved my life. 
Doesn't look like it. What is it? What is it? Lethal. Side quest? No, it's just lore. Favor. Hates me, but they don't understand. Way to protect my home. Bless you. Look here. These board stones destroyed. And this cathedral like someone jammed in its place? What fools? Search for the dark scent. Hmm. I wonder if maybe I missed like a prisoner somewhere. Okay, well there's the dark scent. Alright, there's a couple prisoners somewhere else. Wait, what? Okay. Got confused there for a sec. Whoa, what the? <laughs> that felt a little disjointed. I probably lagged. Streaming default isn't Giga Rushing to the end game. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, don't get me wrong, I want to see that stuff, but at the same time, it's just. Take your time, man. It's not like it's a ladder or anything. I don't understand people. 
I was watching a YouTuber give a review of the game. Just someone that plays Diablo games. Um, they immediately opened with, you know, how they were going to rate the game. And they said they weren't going to take the campaign in into account because they skipped over it and didn't care about it. I'm like, alright. Yeah, that's a good way to give a rating of a game. I clicked off the video the moment the dude said that. Ah! Oh no. Stupid freeze. Ice one. There we go. I think part of the problem of Russian is like certain classes have their class specific quests start in another act, which I think is a bit of a mistake. Like Barbarian's one, for example, is in act two, so it starts highlighting it and it starts kind of telling you to go in that direction a bit early. So I don't blame people for doing that. From what I've read, they've already got two planned out. I mean, I'm willing to bet that they're gonna add, like, either a Paladin or a uh, Crusader class, because I think that's the only thing really missing. Like, night and day compared to the threes. Yeah, I mean, ignoring... There's certain things that are a, a bit overused, like, uh taking things to pedestals. The actual story is, is good. But I mean, all games in the RPG genre to some degree get you to do a fetch quest, so it's like, it's fine. Man, I keep getting the ice affixed. <laughs> Why does this keep happening? Act one, it was all plague, 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 plague. So I got plague resistance. Now I have plague resistance. Everything's ice now that I've left the ice area. No, I know it's random. I will say, I can't believe they brought back extra health, but... They got rid of that in Diablo 3 because people hated it, so... I don't know.
It's interesting to see it back. It's so annoying. I think that the, the thing that is a little egregious is just the... The shattering. Making yourself vulnerable like that. I don't know, I feel like the Barbarian should have more resistance to that. It reminds me of D3 and um, those demons that would apply that debuff that would just pretty much delete your armor. And it was just, okay, if you're playing a melee class, well, that's your own fault, isn't it? For picking a melee class. And it certainly feels that way sometimes. They're both, they're both freezing. Like what stronghold was it? There was one stronghold in particular, it took me ages just because they were just... These three things that would move around quickly and shoot ranged projectiles, I'd have to avoid them, and they wouldn't hang around long enough for me to be able to hit them. I don't know, man. The extra health stuff. Like, at this point, this isn't even hard, and it's taking longer than the Elite. It's okay. I'm sure they'll fine tune it. I heard someone got to 100 already, and it took them 54 hours. Need more fury. But I would imagine that's like 54 hours of just skipping everything and just A to B, A to B, A to B, A to B, which... I mean, impressive, but... There's no ladder, man. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what people's rush is. If you have gotten to 100, yeah, I would imagine that's the case now, because that was yesterday, I think I read that. I think it's because there was that competition of, if you're playing hardcore, if you reach the 100, you'll get your name engraved in something. There was some drama over that that I was reading. Like, some... People were complaining that journalists had an unfair advantage because they had access to the game and would hit level 100 before anyone. Which, ridiculous notion, like... I'm sure there are journalists that are good at games, I'm sure there are, but they're not top-tier players that would figure stuff out better. Now that the tunnels are cleared and the farmers are I don't cleared, know. We can start I'm just here chilling. I'll just the play it my way. reason after he sees results. Thank you. It's winter in Australia, so I'm gonna be chillin'. Instead of sweating in summer. Enjoyment tops up all meta player. Yeah. I mean, there's, we have years to get to optimal meta player.
And it's not gonna be like... This time around, it's not gonna be like D3 where you had to play campaign for a while. Before they finally let you skip it. Like, that. with this, they've taken that into account. So, like, even skipping through the campaign, there's no benefit to it. Because you're not learning any strategy at all. I don't know, maybe I, I don't understand that world. But I'm just taking everything in, looking at the environments, and... Sometimes I'm, I'm making jokes, like the fact that all the travelers in Act 1 seem to be Irish. For some reason, like, there's no accent difference. I mean, like, I kind of understand it now, because they all come from this region here, but... Yeah. It was funny for all. Man, why are Irish people in trouble in this game constantly? I understand now. Oh, it's you again. Okay, well, this is fine. The one thing I'm sad about, which I hope they address soon, is the way that... For some re Okay, so they, they're encouraging us to 100% areas. Explore and collect things and do quests. They have a counter for it. That's great. Love that we have a lot to do. But the problem is there's no way to track it. I don't know what side quests I'm done, so if I refer to a master list of side quests, I don't know. I don't know what dungeons I've done. I don't know what places I've been to. So there's no real way for me to like kind of refer to a guide or something and be like, oh, okay, this is the quest that I've missed. Nah, it's just... There's no way to track it. The dungeons you have to pretty much write down which ones you've done manually so you can track them yourself. This is a kind of an oversight. So I'll probably have to go through just the initial area again and do the dungeons one by one. Dungeons are easy to see if you haven't gotten the first completion thing you haven't done. And, but see, I was trying to work that out, but the numbers didn't add up. Like, let me show you. Maybe I overlooked it. But I was trying to add up, okay, which ones have I done? So I saw that symbol and I added those up, but it still didn't make sense to me. The aspect of efficiency. What is this? Let's see. Crap, oh, now. Yeah. Basic skill reduces the mana cost, sorcerer. Cool, I, I have a sorcerer that I'm playing, so that's fine. Um, got here. Right, so if we check out Fractured Peaks, for example, it says I've done 13 dungeons. So let's just count them. So that's one. Right, on first complete. Two. Three. Maybe I miscounted. Four. Five. Six. I only count. I only counted six. See what I mean? 
I was trying to figure this out, like, how do I know which dungeons I've done? And I thought it, I thought it was this to begin with as well, but then I, you know, I moused over and I'm like, hang on, that doesn't make any sense. And I, I don't think I've gotten this one. Like, I think it's just, all this is, is just revealing it. Like, sometimes it reveals it, but there's no way to know which ones I've actually done. I've done 13 of them. I don't know what those 13 are. Like, half of these should be lit up, but they're not. So, yeah. And then there's the side quest thing. I have three side quests left. I don't know what those... Like, I've tried looking at a master list and tried to figure it out, but I couldn't. I was like, okay, well... I walk around the map until I find the quests. It's it's a bit of an oversight. A bit of a major one, especially if, you know... There's rewards associated with this. Like, I do want to get this done. So, it's it's a bit strange to me. So for this area, I'm not doing any dungeons, and then I'm gonna do them all, like, in one... Have I found all of them? Fair... Well, in that region, fairly certain, yes, because the map coverage is, like... I just have 11 unknown places, and it's just, like, little bits on the map. I mean, I would imagine, at worst, there's one missing, yeah, on the map. I, I was gonna go around and get the map coverage, but after I saw that just, I couldn't really track anything properly, I, I kind of gave up and just moved on. But that being said, I did uh, do that last night with a friend on a separate character, and it told me I found 100% of the map before... We actually found 100% of the map, like it gave us the notification, hey, you've explored everything. But there were still four areas to find. So even that is, uh, is not working properly. Interesting, like, interesting thing on that other character is got to three quests remaining as well. So I imagine it's the same three quests we just haven't found. Side quest is done. Alright, I'm gonna go do this and hopefully it won't glitch on me this time. Maybe I should just run. They just seem to keep coming back. Oh, come on. I'm not ready. Uh, I need to refresh my potion as well. Do one of these.
Okay. After January the hunt, ooh, that's a good one. Dust Devil, finally get something. Finally get something. Yes, Hammer's gonna generate Dust Devil. Finally got something. Everything has been kind of. I mean, yeah. If I would use leap and charge, it would probably be nice, but I haven't got anything. This is gonna have actual repercussions to what I'm doing. I like the idea of just smacking the ground so hard it creates a tornado. Don't add a track or someone will build a website that you just click a battle tag into and it'll spit out dungeons and what quests you've missed. Like, okay, they did it with WoW? Okay, yeah, that would be useful. I mean, as long as they have something that people can read data from, then yeah. Uh, one way or another, I hope there's a way we can do it. It's just... I feel like that bit of feedback would have come up in other games. Like, if it did happen in WoW, that just makes it weirder, because you would think they would have learned that lesson. It makes it a little bit more of an oversight. I'm curious to see how extra health is going to go in later difficulties. Right now it's fine, but with D3, the higher you went, the worse that effect got. So, I don't know. We'll see if they maybe capped it this time or something. Extra health and shielding minions, man. They, they were the worst two things in D3. <laughs> My god, shielding minions.
Okay, this in an enclosed space is really good. Saw that tornado rip through them. I'm glad that this gives you an opportunity to dodge it instead of just always activating. Okay, I'm not gonna go to the middle one. Because I know that's where I'm supposed to end up. mid swing alright try again eventually I usually play hardcore in Diablo but I don't know if I'll have the guts to play it in this iteration I haven't seen that load screen before, that looks cool. Oh, repairs up there. They got used to Q over Shad. <laughs> Just started to autopilot. Okay.
Why? I keep getting ice. I fix this. there these little quill enemies. There we go. Okay. Hunter should be over here somewhere. Or maybe above, I don't know. I'm just leaving the middle one to last so it doesn't glitch on me again. There wasn't one here, was there? See if it works this time. Yay, it didn't glitch. <laughs> it actually spawned. Hooray. I'm not gonna waste my time 15 minutes looking for this thing that didn't exist. So this is what was supposed to happen. <laughs> this makes more sense now. Damage to this thing. Oh, I'll turn back to normal. Yeah, 
You have tornadoes too. It's the height of the tornado wielders. Stand. Summons. Get rid of one, there's not three waiting. Is about. Ow. Jeez, that was hot. Even then, I still didn't escape it. Go, go, go. Hammer. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> okay. Casting the... Uh... Is that a... It is an upgrade. But I'm not using double swing. I mean, I could swap to it and it would do something pretty cool. But I think we're fine. Hooray. This, no, it just turned into an area of multiple dungeons. Okay. I'm gonna walk around here and get map coverage while I'm here. Dampness says, Look,
Ooh, blast wave. People are dying over there. Alright, I mean, keep going this way. Ooh. Okay, I've wandered into a camp. <laughs> Uh, hold on, I'm just looking at the map here. Okay, I got a reference to where I am. Looks like there's a little thing here. I think. <laughs> These events are fine, I just feel like these things spawn too slowly. not keeping up. This is annoying. They're all ranged characters. I have to walk up to them individually. Like, of course I'm not going to keep up. No chance here. Yeah. The stuff like this, where it's just, again, fuck you for picking a melee class, basically. wasn't challenging, I'm just sad that I couldn't do it. Lots of jank of melee alerts with teleporting abundance. They fell out of port away behind some walls and have to run back to you. <laughs> I have seen that a couple times. Yeah, it's funny. Okay, there we go. Oh shit, right! <laughs> Gotta attack him! <laughs> Just... I think the law behind that is they sneeze when they're in combat, and when they sneeze they just teleport accidentally, and then they just have to run back. That's my head cannon.
Oh, this is a town. Well, that's fine. Nay, traveler. The traps have yielded naught and won't for some time. This land needs time to recover. Thorn beasts are still in abundance, though. Haven't shown signs of corruption, but a tough meat that and too smart for normal traps. I hope these new snares will yield better results. Okay. Collect. It's a bit away. Let me collect quests before I go over there. Corpses covering open water, rubbing themselves with gallowine. Barely done any good. Folk have had heavier worries on their minds. But the flies bit our last milk and cow to death. The problem ain't going away by ignoring it. I have some coin saved if he can help with the infestation. Okay. Oh, easy. That's just out there. something but someone someone like you in fact you look the worldly sort would you be able to travel to the under the fat goose inn in the highland wilds and let torben the innkeeper know niall will be there shortly to settle his tab i likes me a drink see and that place is the best ale in these parts that that seems legit certainly nothing could go wrong there Okay, the innkeeper's over there. Ah, I mean, there's a bunch of stuff here I can do, so let's just do it. Why is it highlighting these things? Or is this another quest? No, this is another quest. This is the plague thing. Hang on. Uh, us and Tesla, that's the one. Right, okay. Wait, is, is this just a kill them all thing? It's starting to look like it. Potions always applied.
Okay. <laughs> there was a red dot on the map. I went back and it just disappeared. That's fine. Oh. I can get the mate from here as well. Is this one of these ones where they just respawn? No, there's, there's a larger area. Blood of Ale. This should give me what I need. Broken carving. That's not even a side quest that's pointed out on this map that I'm looking at. Interesting. Okay, by the looks of a... There's a bunch of shrines in the pockets of this, so I may as well go get them now. Call the uh, uh, <laughs> not my ultimate. Here first. There should be two side quests here. Meet! Come here. 
over that. I got a bunch of meat here. I'm not if I might not even have to go to that other area. Ooh. Oh god. I'm not ready yet. You guys need to go. drop on huh interesting maybe these are locked behind something there should be quests here that's not appearing what does it say kill werewolves or item drop drops from any chest the wrong hands. Okay, I think I got the wrong hands one. It says kill werewolves. Okay. Is it not guaranteed? I usually do okay with. It's getting into these multi ones. Nice, good level up. <laughs> Convenient level up.
I mean, whatever, it's a damage up. <laughs> Even if the skill's not useful. Yeah, where am I going with this now? Alright, uh, last rank of Warcry. Not using bleed. I mean, the rest is kind of just passives, really. Oh, yeah, the pit fighter thing. Right, I forgot about this. Weapon mastery skill. I don't have weapon mastery skills. So it'd probably go up this way. It just depends how many points I have to work with here. I'll probably just increase shout durations, I think is probably the good one, since I'm doing double shout. Descendants. Perhaps there's hope after all. Maybe we'll try planting the fields again. How's this going? Nearly there. Okay, we'll do that when we go settle the tab. Alright. interested in the meat. Where is the meat? Oh, over there. Ah, 
We'll sleep well tonight with full bellies. I can't even remember the last time that happened. You've done more than you know. Okay. Did I, did I get reward? Ah, ah. <laughs> okay, uh, nearly. This looks all right, Ma. Do you think we can eat? There's a horned woman in the moors spreading corruption, if that's what you mean. Yes. She's after the druids who vanquished Astaroth. Ah, that madman the Fane lives out there. We already tried checking on him. Got as far as Boglinstone Circle, and then the druid's wolf companion appeared and bit one of my men. I'm already short on knights. Not going to risk what I have left on some bastard who hates the cathedral. Uh depends if okay, it looks like we can cut that way. Just looking at my map. Ow. I mean, we're heading there for the main quest later anyway, so it's fine. Okay, there's one over here. Somewhere here. There it is. Hey, that got the reward as well. Nice. points okay uh, we're going into shout durations increased uh, let me look there's apparently one over here I may as well clear this area out while I'm here Oh, 
I'm, nope. Apparently there's a quest in that gap there. Hang on. First, let's get the map coverage here. Hopefully it'll register in a sec. Come on! <laughs> I think I have to climb up there. Yeah, I have to climb up there. That's fine. Okay, that's it. What's the note on this one? Kill bears for an item drop. But I got the feeling that all my missing quests are just these ones where you have to kill. Because it looks like it's a, it's a random drop. Which might explain why I haven't found them. Because the other one up there it said kill wolves. I did, and it didn't drop. So... Huh. Yeah, we're doing this one. This one's a good one to do. Ooh, this might be tricky though with the, the kamikaze stuff. gonna be much worse. Just ignore, just go straight for the ones. Yeah, it worked, it worked. Where are my potion drops? Ah, oh, this is annoying! No, I need to get this, these shamans. Come here.
cows. Is this the cow level? Little, little suspicious, not gonna lie. I wouldn't be so, I mean, surely that's in the game this time around as well. They had to. It has to be somewhere. I'm gonna go get a key just in case. A chest around cows, hmm. Yeah, no, that's not suspicious at all. Why is it giving an exclamation on the wardrobe? Oh, what the heck? I'm not sure where that came from. Yeah, sure. Where's the vendor down here? Yes, have a wee gamble. We've got a couple keys and we'll go. I figured it was worth a shot. <laughs> Where the stars around your neck. Doing poison resist. Sapphire. Hmm, I think I should save that. about these? Yeah, it's all the same cost. Alright. Even yellows cost the same as that. Sorry, I'm just marking the altars is done. Ooh, that was brutal. This one here. Oh, 
Ugh, those are the that appeared behind me, I'm fine. There's not that many altars left from what I can see in this pocket. I'm trying to stay on top of the potion thing. Just in the out. Ah. Boots. What have we got? Critical strike grants movement speed. That's good. That's something. somewhere. Ooh, that's a lot of stuff in this corner, jeez. So trap, nice work. Got 
far as some matter of a specific what effects cast, yeah. I don't think I've seen that. Or maybe I have and I just haven't paid attention to it. talking about <laughs> as in yeah I get what you mean um I mean on this character it seems to be that I'm getting stuff for Call of the Ancients constantly or Furious Charge on my Sorceress I keep getting stuff for Ice even though I'm Lightning Constant frozen armor, frozen orb, just all that over and over again, nothing else. This dust double thing is honestly the closest I've come to having something useful for what I'm doing, but it's even then, it's not, it's indirect usefulness, it's not like it's specific to the skill that I'm choosing to go with. Okay, that's already all connected, it's all good. Spider area. It's going to run through here. Holy crap, that's a lot of spiders. I just want to see the hammer go to town on them. Love the sound of that hammer just dropping and slamming. Basic skill, gain attack speed, nice, nice, there we go, that's actually very, very useful. Finally, something good. Because 
because I can extract that out and put it on a hammer instead. <laughs> Oh. Oh, he will, will he? You must be the fifth person he sent this week while proclaiming his intention to make good on what he owes. <laughs> that, that was it, okay. Turn right off the hooks. In their hurry, they left blood on the steps. Amateurs. Nairn and Tavish, local mischief makers, have also been absent. Love how you can get 7 out of 5 on a skill from extra ranks. Yeah, that's a throwback to D2. Plus 1 to skills. Isn't the same without it. killed a brute there and has been wearing its horn around his neck seven feet tall it breathed fire ma would be so proud i got sick of the gloating insulted his horn size now we have this wager i must get a bigger one you can see how it's going say we're friends right how about you get me a horn and i'll give you the coin for the wager Remember, a really big one. If you insist. Really, none of them have dropped it. None of them have dropped it. to bring the goose to him. One last drink together beneath her wings. We agreed to a list of last deeds, you know? Could you help me finish it? I like to think it'd give Taver some semblance of peace. Prove he's not to be forgotten. If we place his daggers at the locations on the list, oh boy. we mark our mischief eternal. Let's get to it then. Okay, hang on, that'll have to wait. Flash place towers just dagger okay, they're all areas I've been.
Let's ignore them. <laughs> ah, crap. Kind of hard to ignore that one. Ow! All oh, those fucking bows. There was one off screen. I hate those ballistas. They just seem to do an insane amount of damage. It says entrance, it doesn't mean go in, so I guess that's fine. These bows suck so annoying. Tavish interrupted a cathedral service once, nipped a prayer drake for his cold feet. Priest was furious. Tavish never graced a church again, but swore he'd thumb his nose at the lot. <laughs> what better place than their old nose taken by the young girl? <laughs> I still haven't used any of the vital stuff. and show them who's high and mighty around here. We done? He's done. <sighs> oh, I have to tell Tavish. We tricked her victory. Oh. 
Okay, uh, I'll go here first. No demon horn from this area. Dead, but you know better. Oh, who's torpent to skill that now? Can't imagine I'll rail him so. <laughs> oh, please take the goose back to her nest. I'm going to stay a while longer and finish this last pint with Tavish. Just one more. Take the goose back to her nest. Oh. Okay, see, that's disappointing. I wish I could put it on my back. Just carry it. There's so many quests where you have to carry an item, like, really? Couldn't put a goose on my back? That's disappointing. Same without him. And Nairn. They're why the goose stays open. Even during the hardest times. A respite from the darkness of this world. Oh, what? I guess let's do that. Hang on, there's another quest here now. Skin match. Hold on. Since it's here. Torn throat. Hmm. Too clean for a beast. Messy for a man. It's the bear of black wield. Returned from the days of Ash to silence us all. Tore out their throats, he did. Women, children, any who faced the man or left wheezing blood. <laughs> hmm. There is no bear. But something has eyes for our merchants. Others have yet to arrive from the eastern road. Not normal to miss their midway pint. Something's wrong. Okay. Uh, I mean... Ow. Yeah, let me do that first. The other two are in the same area.
Looks like carrion rubbish. <laughs> A lot of people are using the rubbish bag. I love how they just run away when I'm talking to people. It's hard to make out the animal's form from the bit that's here. But I see the clawed limbs of a large predatory beast. If you find any other parts of this, bring them to me at once. I will ask others to scour the countryside for the pieces as well. We can't risk the pieces of this falling into the wrong hands. Okay. Probably closer. The forest has gone mad. We're not going out there again. Wait, there's still another... Wow, okay. 13 of these left. The fuck? Oh, okay. <laughs> No, it's certainly not a uh, glitch at all. Search for the missing merchants. Vulnerability thing is so annoying. I think too many things apply it.
No sign of him yet. There's no sign of him. Oh, no, there's the players. Ah, there we go. Contract that promised equal weight of blood and coin. Only the desperate called them. But those were desperate times. Smoke's billowing from the southern ridge. The fires have returned. <laughs> no time wasted. Can you see to the source of the smoke? There's likely a connection in all this. I'll see no harm reaches the goose. Source of the smoke, which is down there. All right. Out of these charges. <laughs> I'm only doing this because of money.
Guess this is also the fire. Ah, it's a dungeon, sort of. <laughs> oh, shit. Stealth is not my thing. Buried traps and a lookout who doesn't mind his back. Okay. Predictable, disappointing. The bear has finally left its den. You never should have returned here. I thought he was about to turn into a bear. Not gonna lie, I would have been cool. Sought able bodies and conscripted our lot to defeat Astaroth. Our ruthless tactics were put to measure, and with time, the demon was defeated. But the things I saw humbled and horrified every part of me. My kin and our leader, Stana, did not share my shame. They delighted in the fires, yearned for their return. I was there when they set upon Brion, saw the madness in their eyes. The days of Ash had taken their minds, so I cut them down one by one and left them to be claimed by fire. After years of quiet, it seems something survived that night. These bodies and the merchants were meant for me. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> we'll see the black wheel together. Uh, speak with Torben. Okay. This is a pretty long series of quests. Aye. With their trap failed, they'll only grow more persistent. The pyres prove they are still drawn to the demon's work. The scar to the east marks where Astaroth fell to the heroes. I'd wager they'd find comfort in that cursed place. I'll join you there. East, huh? Wow. Awesome. <laughs> Same place. Alright. That'll save time.
Ugh, all right. Potion plan. Broken totems. With different base spring to our tier. Okay, we can look, we can do that later. Them joined us. <laughs> Didn't recognize them. Okay, now we look for both objectives. Gonna be significant for a sec. Uh, hang on. I'll piss off. <laughs> That's a good sign. If I see someone else around here, that means they're probably looking. There we go. This is a giant horn thing. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of these shamans. Good, we are back up. Not ready. Good. Good. Excellent. That was uh, a bit easier. Now just do the rest of it. Hey, Corin thought today wasn't a day off. Yeah, I mean, I wanted to play this stuff. And I figured since I'm playing this, I might as well just stream it. I don't feel like sitting around and watching stuff, so here I am. Like, I'm just going to be playing this pretty much and just kicking back. Nothing else. Yeah. 
You guys not. Let's see. There you go. Just stretching. Ugh. <laughs> Don't have to look for something to watch while you work. Fair enough. Yeah, I'm just gonna be whacking shit with my uh, big stick. Makes sense. There we go. A mercenary woman. It's pretty miserable out there the today. Along the road. <clears throat> it's supposed to rain extremely tonight, so. And, and tomorrow's just gonna be nothing but rain. Watch. watch them burn us. One by one. Hello, is a Twitch chat. Stana. Of all the devils who could have survived that night, why did it have to be her? None matched her joy for suffering. Her eyes said enough. Stana's madness ends here. If she wants the bear, she'll have him. Meet me near the depths. We'll find her within. Hmm. Where are we going now? Oh. Okay, so now these quests that I couldn't find, Thank it's you. just this. To guess, right? Out of dress. Yeah. That's pretty much you hear in Melbourne every other season. It's, you don't know how to dress really. Summer is the only season where you consistently dress the same, but everything else is just you bring something because it's going to change potentially. It's only right she joins them. There are days where I change out of pants and shorts. <laughs> it's just multiple times. Oh, uh, we're doing a dungeon. Okay. Well. What's the coldest? Uh, I mean, average is... If I convert it to cel Celsius from Fahrenheit, like... It's like 59 is average, and then... If you're talking, like, very cold, 41. The coldest it's been... Which is negative 2 Celsius, and that was in the 1800s, is 28. But that's, of course, speaking about the city areas. It doesn't count the mountain areas where... It can drop a bit below that. Twelve Celsius in the summer. <laughs> That's not summer. Oh man. Uh, it's 
Mr. Does this person look very, very tiny? They sure are dropping a lot of traps. Get stunned. I just laid the hammer. Fifties aren't bad if there's no wind. It can be windy. It varies, honestly. Sword. put my strength now it so peace. his nickname is the bear and started a place called the goose I, deserve. I was so used to only seeing terror in faces it took a long time to recognize the worth of a smile please i thought he was going to be a literal bear because you know we're in an area where there's droids but no not a literal bear Imagine someone can transform into a bear running a tavern. Oi! You got one! Ain't that a beaut? This will show that smug bastard. Wait a second. This looks nothing like Maddox. Why, that lying bastard. I bet he's been parading around a goat horn. <sighs> I'm gonna kill him. What's that? Someone lying in a dick measuring contest? You don't say. I mean, metaphorical dick, but dick nonetheless. Uh, I need to go salvage. Which town has the salvage stuff? This town. The whole forest has gone mad. We're not going out there again. We've managed to save some for the forge. Okay, before I do that, there's a... Should go here first. Ah, leveled up. Um, goes into that. I'll probably do that one as well. I mean, do I get another ability? What else do we have? We have... Kick. For knockback. Leap. Damage reduction. Brawling skill. 
on a brawling. Oh, I'm not going to take brawling skill. They're not going to damage. Fury generation is increased. I mean, these two. It feels like I'm just going to get passives now and nothing else. There's another shout there. <laughs> you know what? I'll get a third shout. Just three screams. That'll that'll be great. Do I play Final Fantasy games? Uh, I haven't played one in a very, very long time. The last one I played was the one with lightning. When it was on the PS3, so... It's been a minute. I know there's a new one coming out for PS5, so maybe... change a couple things up. I mean, these are good nerds, but like... <laughs> Am I really gonna get? I, I am gonna do this. Good lord, though. Look at all the shouts. Final Fantasy Marathon? No, that would take years. Some of those games are like 200 hour commitment, minimum. Once you start getting into the past, like, uh, the Super Nintendo ones, that's when they start getting into the, the triple digits in terms of playtime. I, would, I wouldn't play anything else. I enjoy the games, but I'm not, like, a super fan of them. I mean, I like this. God, the constant shouting is funny. I mean, one of the RPG games I do want to play soon is just Chrono Trigger, because I have the DS version of it. That's considered definitive, but... Whatever that's gonna be. Where's the statue? Ah, there it is. Okay.
on a go here next. I might rework my build so the shout is a bit stronger already. Have I played Kingdom Hearts? I have not. No. Because at the time when that series started, did not have a job, nor did uh, I have a PS2. And I kind of got into PC gaming more at that time. Would I? Uh, I do have means of playing it. It's just, it's a long commit again. It'd be one of those things where if like multiple people are saying, hey, I, it'd be great to see you play it, then I would do it. Kind of like Donkey Kong, like, I, I personally wanted to play that, but multiple people said, no, do it, do it, do it. So, that's why I'm playing Donkey Kong. Uh, where am I going? Oh, yeah, here. Yeah. I got that collection that has the first few games for PS4 and then because there was like a discounted copy of 3 I, I got that at some point so it's like sitting here somewhere I was like I'm sure at some point someone will ask about it and I have the means there's just not enough there's really just not enough time Yeah, I mean, never say never. It's a possibility. It is. It is part of the collection of games I have. It's just, it ultimately depends on what I, what is out at the moment. So, still gotta get through Zelda. I mean, this is gonna get playtime on stream until the campaign's over, at least. And then after that, I got some stuff from the backlog to visit. Only the concept of like polyphasic sleep was easier to maintain where you could be awake more more times in the day. Thing. Ah! We got tricked by the world event. <laughs> okay. What? Hey. Perhaps the body was one of those that I sent out to search for the fragment too. I must regretfully hope for that. To think that another might hold it is terrifying. This part fits onto the first bit that you brought me here. I believe it's the carving of a bear. Oh, yeah, another bear Maybe thing. We're still missing the head. The shape of the legs and body are clear enough. 
We cannot risk that a bear totem be the Shola bears, yeah. Not with all that we've already seen. Perhaps if you're to find the last piece, you should hunt the bears themselves. Using only part of a totem could have caused a flawed transformation. Hunt the bears themselves. Well, I know where there's some bears. I'm trying to think if there's anything in the second half of the year that has been announced that I really want to play, but I don't think there is. So, unless... Because the thing is... It's June, and June is the time where every single company will announce a bunch of shit for the second half of the year. So, whilst I say this now, like, yeah, second half of the year, I think... I don't think there's anything coming out that I want to play. That'll probably change in the next couple of weeks. Because it's, it's what used to be E3. This, is it next week? I think it's next week. So, Sony will do their thing, Microsoft will do their thing, and... I'm not sure Nintendo will, but... I'm sure there'll be some things that'll come out of that. I mean, there's the obvious one, there's Bethesda's big game, Starfield, but... That one is going to be a wait and see for me, because... Bethesda and their track record with releases... Yeah, no. They can't release a game now. And have it have no issues whatsoever. So that one... I, it piques my interest. If I'm gonna play it, will matter on how their launch week goes. Other than that, I, I can't think of anything else in the second half of the year. No company that can do... Alright, look. That's being very, very... pedantic. It's like, I'm not talking about true perfection where there's no issues. When I say no issues, I mean it in the broader sense, like... I don't know, the game not crashing, the game not glitching out, the game... having quests work properly. I'm not talking about the difference between, say, this that has a couple of minor hiccups and, say, a cyberpunk. I'm talking about a cyberpunk scenario. Or, like, more recently, Redfall, where that, that thing was inherently broken. Game companies are definitely capable of releasing something that is polished enough. I'm not asking for perfection. I'm asking for... When it comes time to decide the game... There is a point in time when they can truly look at the game and ask themselves, okay, is this polished and is this in a relatively bug-free state? And a lot of these major companies will be like, okay, we'll fix this later, we'll release it now. We can't, we can't delay this because our shareholders are going to get angry. That happens way too much these days. That's what I'm talking about. And the most recent example, Redfall... The Lord of the Rings game, Gollum. Those are the examples that I'm talking about in terms of being broken. There was the Star Wars game. Like, the list goes on. They, they just all do the same thing. They make a conscious decision to deliver something that's not ideal. And then they just write an apology note. Because they don't want to anger their shareholders. Because the general public won't do anything about it. I think saying that no company can release... ...can release something polished enough is like... Eh. I'm not talking about perfection here, I'm talking about something that... ...if you're talking about school grades, is at least a B, right? I just think back to Cyberpunk, I'm just... The fucking shit show that was, or Fallout 76. The GTA trilogy. B for best I can do. Yeah! I'm not one of these assholes that's gonna expect things to be 
perfect, right? Because I don't think anything can be in the truest sense. Issues will pop up, that's understandable. However, I'm not going to be apologetic and be like, I can excuse this because no one's perfect. That's like, that's such a weird take. It's like, just because true perfection doesn't exist doesn't mean I'm going to excuse mediocrity or less, right? Like, yeah. So I guess just to be clear, I'm talking about those examples where it's just like, it is blatant that anyone looking at this would have gone, listen, we need more time on this game, and executive management went, no, we're releasing this now, we can't anger our shareholders. That's what I'm talking about. We'll release an apology now, and then we'll fix it in a few months, and then it'll be fine. Which... Yeah, it's not the case with this game. This game is fine. Sure, it has its issues. But this is a good release. I've come across a, a few weird problems, like quests not working. But I wouldn't call this broken. Like, it's fine. I'm looking for bears, but none of them have dropped the thing. The higher the price tag, the higher the expectations. For me, price tag, I guess, all it indicates to me is that I should watch myself, basically. When you go to the higher price tag, you're talking about AAA there, and that's where that shit is most likely to happen. It's not that I expect more, it's that I know that, you know, these shitty practices are more likely to happen in that price range. Because there are some games that cost less and I expect a lot out of, like... For example, whenever I hear The Binding of Isaac is getting something new for it, I have high expectations of that, despite that will always be like a... A sub $40 release when you're talking about Australian money. So all price range does to me is indicate, okay, well, let's look at this company's track record. Are they known for releasing stuff that um, is broken on a release? If so, wait a week. The words that I followed in 2021 that have, that did not fail me and I'm sticking to from now on is when a game gets announced and you need to pay attention to this, when a game gets announced, if what they show off immediately is just a cinematic and they don't really show gameplay, and they're saying the game is going to release in about a year's time, that game is most likely not going to release in a solid state. I have yet to see an example where they've done a, 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 an announcement trailer with a, you know, just a cinematic trailer, and then it's, the game's ended up fine on release. So, no gameplay, no buy on first release. Trust me on this one. If you follow that rule, you won't be disappointed. <laughs> Redfall fell into that category. What you mean by that is the level of polish and a lower budget, you can forgive more janky stuff. Uh, I suppose. I can understand that you'd have a more leniency towards an indie team. So, it would appear that these quests, they're random drops, which is going to be annoying. That might explain why I never found those three quests. Alright, let's just forget about it for now. Not going out there again. Wait, speak with... Oh. There's a horned woman in the moors. Spreading horned woman in the moors, okay. That's so weird. I think for me, it doesn't have anything to do with team size. I think it's fundamental when you can objective. It doesn't matter what your team size is, right? 
you can objectively look at something, like what you've created, and be like, okay, is this in a state that I think is good enough, right? That I'm proud of, that, you know, no one's going to complain about. And I mean that in the sense of stuff being broken, right? Like, there's a differ difference of opinion. Sometimes you might think that the way something plays is fine, but then someone says it sucks. I'm not talking about that. Like, anyone, it doesn't matter the team size, can look at something and go, hey, listen, this is completely broken, we can't release it in this state. It's when the decision is made to release that stuff to people and charge them. When it's, like, pretty fucking crystal clear that shit's broken, that's the thing I take issue with, regardless of team size. It doesn't matter, like, it's an ethical thing. You don't have to be a, a small team or a gigantic team to be able to analyze something and be like, hey... This is morally wrong to release something in this state. So that that's how I feel about it. I like it when a developer's like, okay, we're gonna need more time, we're gonna delay it. And if they're a small team, I'll be like, that's honestly fair enough, take your time. And a large team, it's like, well, I appreciate you doing that. Because the alternative is we got something like Cyberpunk, basically. <laughs> there was that action RPG, Wilson, that got absolutely eviscerated by people because... They were a smaller indie team, and they decided to release the game in a state that was... It was broken. There were certain skills that just straight up didn't work. Passives were like, the game was broken. And they still decided to release it and charge people for it. They went with the let's just charge people now and fix it later approach. And for that, I mean, I don't think there should be leniency. It's just... They made the choice to release it in that state because they wanted money. Ooh, this is cool. I don't have potions, so this is bad. Let's hope nothing happens here. This is just so much darker than anything that was in D3. Just, yeah, just a blood tree. It's, it's fine. Where are we going? Okay, we're going here. It's a lot of blood. You picked up Wilson for five euro two weeks ago. It's in a rather nice state, but when you demoed the game at release, as I say, horribly broken. Yeah. And, you know, it's, un it's unfortunate because that's a case of... I think they had something good there. I just think whoever was in charge of the decision-making there, they, they basically fucked up, <laughs> to put it... to put it mildly. <laughs> They should have just said, okay, we need, we really, really need a lot more time of development. And, you know, just 
admit that things were faulty, man. Like, When that game worked, I did enjoy it for what it was worth, but it's just, you know... It's a shitty feeling when you pick something up, you're excited about it, and you trust that things are okay, and then when you go to play it, oh, when they're not okay, it's, it's not a good feeling. And the best they can do is just say sorry. That's basically it. But they would have known. You know, I, I work at a company where we do software, and whilst it's not game development, it's still the same thing, like, in the sense that you're constantly analyzing the state of things, and when it comes to delivering something, you talk about the things that are working, the things that aren't working, and when you get to a worst case scenario where shit's extremely broken, there's a point where that level of things, you know, there's a report about it. It's like, hey, this shit is broken. It's not like people work in a vacuum and they can't analyze that. It doesn't matter how big your team is. Like, you can do that. So that's what I mean. Like, at, at some point, they realize, shit, this is, this is broken, but we need to release it. All right, let's just release it and fix it later. There's a conversation that that happens where that that happens basically, and yeah, it's it's not great. Usually, it's because at the end of the day, it's a money thing, one way or another. Whether it's a smaller company that's running out of money, or a larger company that doesn't want to piss off shareholders and get sued. <laughs> One way or another, it comes down to that. I just love this build. It's just one, two, three, four. Hammer! <laughs> Let's just use all my screams and then just hammer, 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 hammer. Not gonna lie, I was kind of worried that Diablo 4 would end up in that boat. Of like, we're gonna release something and just fix it later. But I've been pleasantly surprised about Diablo 4. Just, uh, the state at which it's released in. <laughs> if you're really good at your job, you can create a cult around the game and charge people for it and never release it, like Star Citizen. Yeah, I mean... I haven't followed Star Citizen completely. I have friends that have purchased it and are in that world. And to me, it just comes down to a fundamental thing. It's like, I'm sure there are people that work on Star Citizen and it's, you know, adjacent projects. Let's say, in it. <laughs> Let's say now. Um, that are genuinely passionate about and you know i think they're telling the truth in what they want to build i do believe they're telling the truth however this is like classic scope creep it's like they just don't draw the line in the sand and they just keep collecting more money from people and i just think that's kind of taking advantage of people's just i guess love and passion for a genre or gaming in general it's it's dishonest it doesn't matter if you're truthful in what you want to deliver, like, making it seem like the end is near and you're gonna finally get the game just over and over again and 
the goalpost keeps moving. That's that's dishonesty. Even if the end result is your intent to release the game is true. Like, yeah, you do want to release the game and everything you're talking about, I'm sure one day will come to fruition. But you're still kind of preying on hope to get money at the end of the day. In this crimson cradle, let there be born an amalgam of rage. Amalgam of rage. Elder Scroll 6. <laughs> I mean, we have a logo. We know the logo's been developed and finished. But they, like... They haven't given a firm release date to it and said it's coming out, you know, here. And then they pushed it back over and over again. They're just saying soon, which I think that's fine. And they're not asking for your money right now. Let its anger ever burn until it has devoured the whole of this wretched. Yeah, world. honestly, at least soon what it's it's not getting you to expect it to come in a certain month and it's not getting you to put down money, right? So I think that's fine. It's vague enough, it's... You can't be angry if it doesn't come out this year, because soon means soon. Listen, you want to talk about Copium? Metroid Prime 4. Yeah, they even said at one point, don't expect it anytime soon. Like, they were, they were straightforward about it. They said, you know, soon, and, you know, they joked about soon, saying just don't expect it anytime soon. But just know that we're working on it. That's all that they said. Cerebus. Okay, I got some. Ow. How's it already on half HP? I need more health. Okay, thank you. Project Titan. Remind me, what was Project Titan? Rings a bell. So I a fuck ton of health left. It's probably gonna summon more shit. Nah, here we go. More shit. Why is it not taking damage? Okay, it's gone. 
dead. A promise game from Blue Where that was that scrapped and supposedly turned into Overwatch. Oh, you want to talk about Overwatch? How about um the PVE mode? <laughs> that's that's something that was like, yeah, yeah, coming next year. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna release simultaneously with the with the game Overwatch 2. It's gonna release simultaneously. Oh wait, no, sorry, we gotta delay it. We're still working on it though. Okay, you know how we were working on it? Turns out we're not. We just scrapped it because Battle Pass is better. <laughs> they didn't release any details of it, just something they're always working on. Uh, that's fine. I mean, that's just marketing fluff at the end of the day. They're just talking. They're doing something to excite fans and also in potential investors. That's all that is. Maybe a little dishonest, but in terms of the levels of dishonesty, it's not the worst. Like, you, as much as I want things to be true, like a true form of altruism, it just doesn't happen. But, yeah, whatever's closest to it. Wait, what? Oh, it wants me to go outside. There's no way for me to know that. Apparently the scope was too big to be feasible. Yeah, that happens. Maybe they should have uh, hired developers from Star Citizen. That was their problem, I think. Just, I don't know, it entertains me so much. Just three separate screams. The fourth one is technically a scream as well. Not, it's not categorized as one, but the, the barbarian does yell. I just love this idea of just nothing but screams and then just one mighty hammer. already gone and I fear she has taken a piece of you with her a beast born from your blood oh, it's my fault. what part did you have in this a pact with Lilith to help me destroy the knights in return for what I don't Astaroth is hidden. Betrayal. Held I. Why? In her presence. I lost control. Rage consumed me. How is he still talking?
dark. <laughs> Did I just get... Ah, uh, Not usable on my class. But could I just get a dagger for shiving someone? I guess I did, huh? Okay. Guess we're headed that way now. Uh, hold up. Over here, apparently there's a side quest. Let me go get it. The only thing I remember as a kid, um, in terms of something I was excited for... Um, the Nintendo 64 era, they were talking about the 64 DD. And how all these sequels to all these games were gonna get released to, so like... Super Mario 64 2 and a bunch of other stuff. And then... It got... Well, all that got canned, because it released in Japan, and then it just wasn't successful, and they were like, nah, fuck it. Or worse, when you would hear about a game that was going to release, but then they decided to go, no, it's not releasing in Australia. Because it's too late. Whoa, oh, this area sucks. Like, right now, I have interest in a Steam Deck, but I'm not... I'm convinced that that thing's just never gonna release in Australia. It's just... They're gonna announce its successor before it ever gets released. I got stunned by something. Okay, no, that's... that's fair. I'm gonna have to let that go. Yeah, this was kind of bullshit. Not leave me alone. Look at the sheer number of things that I just have to chase down. Because they're just constantly throwing something at me. What's that? You play it a, uh, a melee character, huh? Well, that's what you get for picking a melee character. Might I suggest picking something that has ranged abilities so you don't have to chase things down? Okay, message in a bottle. Stay strong and know that I am and always will be proud of you. No distance could ever change. <laughs> Seen too much. Far too much. Couldn't look all day. I suppose I last saw him near the center of town. Center of town, okay. What you'd want with him. Who's asking? Uh, apologies, Wanderer. Do you need something? I believe this is yours. What's this? A letter? This may never reach you. No. 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 Where did you get this? The, the drowned? Closing in? All this time, I've been ashamed of me, Father. I, I 
thought he abandoned us. I'm so sorry. Unless... Wait. I've seen something like this before. An amulet imbued with druidic power. This is a relic Fr from when I was a child. There are people still practice the old ways. I'm not a druid either. I fear. No, I've, I've not the ability to use it. Unless, could, could you use it? <laughs> Me father wouldn't have wanted it collecting dust on a shelf. Worry not. I will take care of it. I wish Mum was here to see. Well, at least now her spirit can rest easy. Thank you, friend. So you know, I, I do appreciate these heartfelt quests. And you get you get an amulet, right? Ooh, that's actually not a bad holy shit, that's actually not a bad amulet. Um Brawling, hold on. It's plus there's two plus one affixes. Brawling is that. Okay, so one of my shouts will get that. What's the other one? Weapon mastery skills. Basic skills, core skills, defensive skill, brawling skill. Nah, that's not useful, really. I'm just looking at this now, it's like, eh, yeah, I mean, I'm not using any weapon mastery skills. So. Could have been useful. What was my plus one to screams? Yeah, I mean, I want to get the shout ability. Um, unstoppable while active. Fortify. Yeah, that's cool. Definitely want to be more tanky. Okay. Uh, I mean, there was stuff that it pointed out here. Anyway, uh, I was going to just take it to a, a blacksmith and just salvage it. <laughs> just this, this family heirloom, heartfelt conversation, just immediately take it to the blacksmith to salvage. But it was, it was actually a pretty decent amulet. Just, it doesn't really offer me anything at the moment. I just realized I'm almost well, 50. <laughs> <Not even. laughs> I mean, Act 2, level 50. That's, yeah. There are two kinds of players there's me. 
And there's the one that I ran into yesterday that was like level 5 in, the, in this act. I think it might have been level 7, but it was definitely single digits. That would have been you. Well, it depends. If you were to play a game like this, would you go through all the side quests and try to explore everything? Or would you just go straight to the end and not care? It's, got, it's not really a skill thing, it's more that that person just did not care about exploring, just went straight for the yellow marker and is like, no, let's just go straight to the end. That's what I mean. You would do exploring, then you would be like me. You'd be like level 48 and only in Act 2. You wouldn't be like that person who's level 7 and already Act 2. Just did not explore, just... Saw the yellow marker. Okay, yep, A to B, A to B, A to B. Just let's just get to the end. I don't care about the story. Which, yeah, I don't know. I find that a bit weird to do, especially since there's no contest right now. But to each their own. Damage. Finish the campaign around 48. <laughs> Man. Out of potions. Oh shit, that's not good. Potion, thank you. Okay, I came here purely to look for a quest. There's nothing here. Let's just leave. Wait, what is it? Oh, that's an event. Don't care about that. Alright, we are going... Yeah. I mean, if I want all those rewards, I'm gonna have to do all that stuff anyway, so I may as well just take it slow and enjoy the game. And then later, yeah, if I want to be optimal and skip shit, then I'll know what quests are a pain in the ass, and I'll know what to look out for, but for now, just chillin'. My hammer sings on your return. Okay, uh, where are we going? Is that anything? Not the Sarga. Oh, it was blocked off. Let's see if it's still blocked off. Yeah, it's still blocked off. Okay. Um, I just want to do map fulfillment. Okay. So we're going up in that northern corner of the map. Let me just bring that up. Okay, there's like a... Get a point... It's like there-ish. All right. I haven't really done um what do I got? I can do prefix and suffix. Dirty Furious Iron Legendary Little Lonely Meticulous Nocturnal Overwhelming Resourceful Season Twisted Wily
Dirty. Armory, bear, blessed boots, brewer. Casualty, combatant, commoner, conjurer. Dancer, dead eye, delver, drifter, enchanter, executioner. Uh, but yeah, but I think ever everyone. Everyone goes with the trash thing. I feel like that's that's too obvious. I got rubbish instead of trash. I have trash as well. But I've just seen everyone use it, so I want something else. <laughs> Potential rubbish. Nah, no, nah, no, nah, no. Nah. Just thinking. <laughs> uh, I'm thinking of doing like dirty voice. Essential voice. Magic voice. There we go. Because uh, <laughs> there's the screaming. All right, that'll do. Because that's the bills. It's Screaming and then the hammer brings the the screaming and the voice brings magic. Yeah, I should go to a healer. It's just the potions I don't have any. I forgot to grab it. Seen more people using goat than trash and rubbish. I've seen a lot of trash and rubbish today. There's a whole mess of nights up in Brace Take waiting to buy our grain. Forget the damn good. Oh, there's a town here. There was also potions here. My family, they live in Kortbach, over in the Strand. Things there are dire. And not enough food to go around. I came here thinking to earn some coin. Maybe send some food back to them. But I can't afford to leave work long enough to visit them. And I don't make enough to move them here. Oh. Would you have it in you to take this to my son, Tag? I know he and the others need it more than I. Worry not. I will take care of it. 
Okay. I think I'm too old to experience such darkness again. Food stuffs. Darcel snuck in with the knights posing as muscle. Took something of mine. The bairn was born healthy a fortnight ago. Craves the glow and fire. But the mother is weak. Darcel stole the runic charm I placed to heal her. Bastard probably just wanted quick coin. He may have condemned both mother and child. Deal with him and bring the charm back. All right. Is that it for here? I'm gonna head up that way. Just stop and murder every single dare until it drops the item. This is where I needed to go anyway, so... There's a quest. No, not this one. This one. It's not that one, it's this one. Oh, that's the thing I gotta take off. Alright, fair enough. Excuse me. <laughs> Why is it shambles in quotation marks? Fuck you, Darcel. Okay. Oh, what? Can't go in there. Maybe there's another way around, let's see. Or it's main quest locked, which didn't surprise me. Okay. Come on, let me in. But yeah, it looks like this area is going to be locked behind a quest, most likely. Okay, well that's as far as I can go. Just uh, get this, I guess. Will bend like grass in the wind when the spirits arrive. Ah, oh, you've returned. Thank you. I knew I could rely on you. All right, that's done. Uh. Oh, it's over here. That's easy. Just a teleport away. Thank 
There you go. F from da? Truly? Oh, thank you. We haven't had nothing to eat in days. The little ones can barely keep their eyes open. We miss him terribly. But he's done what needed doing. He's kept the family alive. Thank you again. Okay, there's a little little pocket here. Why do they have so much help? There we go. Okay. Uh, going here. Oh, you dick. Okay. Going in here so I can teleport. <laughs> I just also noticed it's the time. <laughs> uh, I think it's time for an intermission. It's been over three hours, almost four. So I'm gonna get a beverage, chat, and uh, stretch for a bit. But I'll, I'll come back and do some more. Just let me go take a small break for two to five minutes and uh, we'll continue. But if you're watching this later on YouTube, hope you have been enjoying the playthrough of this so far. And uh, see you next time, yeah? Don't forget to click buttons and whatnot. Algorithm stuff. Okay, bye. Bye, YouTube.